So this is the level three app for the Talk To Me. In this one, we are going to uh, have a finished product, everything from the app icon to using the accelerometer in this. So I'm going to have a load screen on this one, just to have it a little bit more uh, finalized. So I'm going to come over here to my user interface, grab my image. I'm going to come here to upload a file. I pre-downloaded uh, uh, just an image that says loading on it. So I'm going to add that loading here. We're going to see it comes up in my uploaded media here. So I'm going to come over to picture and I can now change my image to this picture. Now I want to scale that picture to fit. Uh, I could also do to fill it in the uh, existing space, both on the height and width. Uh, you can also make that picture uh, clickable as well. I'm going to make ours clickable uh, just for this. So as I come to my emulator now, we can see that I have this load screen here. Now, if I come to my blocks, you're going to see that I only have one screen. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add another screen. And I'm going to call this simply screen two. And because I have image one on that screen one, so I can navigate between my screens here, I'm going to click on my image. And we can say when image one is clicked, well, what do we want to have happen? We want to we want to go to load screen two. So we want to be able to switch screens on this. And the way I'm going to do this is come up here and I'm going to go to open other screen name and press that in there. And I need to type in the name exactly into my text box because that's what it's going to look for. So I named mine screen two with capital S. So what's going to happen now is when that uh, image is pressed, I'm going to then move to screen two. Well, my screen two is an empty design screen right now. And I know a few things. I need a button. I need a text box. I need a text to speech. And I'm also going to need an accelerometer. So I'm going to come under to my sensors and I'm going to grab in an accelerometer. Now, in the previous ones, we can talk about how to design this screen like we've talked about. So that'll be up to you. I'm just going to label my button press me really quickly. But again, yours should have more of a polished design to it. Uh, so I'm going to go over to my block coding. And I'm simply going to say when button one is pressed, I want my text to speech, right? Oh, text to speech to speak a certain text. Well, what text do I want it to speak? The input of the text box one's text. So we've already demoed that before. The other thing is I have an accelerometer. Well, when my accelerometer is shaken, they give you that command as well. I can use that same text to speak. Maybe I want it to say what's in the text box and have that be my input, or I could do uh, a standard phrase like stop shaking me. So all of these would be ways to program this, uh, to use that accelerometer. We could have also, just as another, if I come back to screen one, and go to that design screen. I could have used an accelerometer if I come to my sensors. We can drag an accelerometer on this page. Now it's listed. And again, we can see here we can change some default settings on that. I can come to my blocks and I could have done when accelerometer is shaken, or and I can duplicate this. We could also have it go to screen two, or if I had a third screen on my app or things of that nature. 